Hello friends, so I made this video about the frame rates and uh, how I don't like the 23.976 frame rate and I realized that probably a lot of you work on the DaVinci Resolve, whoever is watching this. And if you do, and you do have a file that is potentially 23.976 and it's maybe not the main file or just a short clip that you need to use it in a 24 frames per second uh, timeline, there's a very quick way of changing that in DaVinci Resolve. I'm not sure entirely how does it do it. I'm pretty certain that it does some sort of frame duplication, but uh, it's not that many frames to duplicate, to be honest. It's such a small minute difference that, but it helps you in terms of uh, keeping the consistency in your uh, workflow. So to do that, it's very simple. All you gotta do is grab your file, that's 23.976 uh, FPS. Uh, in my case, I'll just grab a copy of the Batman that I had and make sure you drop it into the media pool and not the timeline. You will be prompted with the frame rate warning saying change project frame rate. Um, you don't have to do that. So you just do don't change. And once you have it in a media pool, just right click on it, select click attributes. And in there you'll have video frame rate. So change that to 24 frames per second, click OK. And then you can drag it on your timeline. If you're going to drop it straight away to the timeline and then do the clip attributes within the timeline, it will not sync up with your media pool and it will think that it's offline so a lot of people get that error and i got it initially and i was like what the hell is going on um yeah so you have to change it in the media pool and then from media pool you drop it into your timeline and yeah this is how you do it see you next one bye